The Eskals ended the Southeast Asian tour with uh, a win, a draw, and a loss. Uh, so they had a bit of everything uh, <laughs> within football, but a bit extra as well. <laughs> so yeah, a, bit, a bit more for your money. Uh, with a, a bit of a fight on the, the last one. Mixed martial arts. Pay for view. <laughs> so maybe that's why the cameraman weren't showing it, because they were filming it secretly, so that they could then sell it later on as a separate event on the uh, mixed martial arts circuit. Um, but did you did you manage to see uh, what started the fight? And first off, just to, to begin the, the analysis. Uh, well, I, see, I, I wasn't to able to, to see what happened. I just... I was like, Arsene Wenger. <laughs> 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 I just read it over Twitter that Misa Bahadur and mm. was missing a tooth already. Mm. <laughs> and then he tweeted that I'm alright, it's just half a tooth. <laughs> so like that. Shout out to Misa, by the way. Hope you're tooth is better now. Because the videos clearly showed yeah. that uh, the Laotian player did punch him in the face and broke his tooth. <laughs> but Apparently I'm not sure how that... Not it, a bad punch. I, I'm not... But not a full punch because he wasn't able to take the entire tooth out. <laughs> anyway, um, I, I'm not sure what happened. Um, Coach, Phil, were you able to see the... the I think... Well, I think it all started with a tackle in midfield, didn't it? So didn't it just sort of handbags mm. and various things were said, obviously, which you do say in a game. Um, it happens, doesn't it? Yeah. And I think, to be fair, that you know, I think certain people have come out and said, well, it shouldn't happen in football. The Laotians did this. The the, the Philippine national team did that. Yeah. It happens. Yeah. You know, we, we've all been there. <laughs> I mean, I, I slapped Mr. Badar and across the back of his head in the Alaska Cup final <laughs> five years ago. I got a red card. It was a penalty. They missed the penalty, and we won one nil. So I mean, <laughs> we've all done stupid things on the pitch. Um, She's like, he's just taking a bit of a battery. <laughs> <laughs> what, what, why, why do people want to hit him? I'm mixed probably about did. thirty years older than me. <laughs> <laughs> right, wait, I'm gonna give him three yards start. He tripped me on the halfway line. I was going back. Right. I give tracking him. Trip me. I picked myself up and ran after him and, and connected. And <laughs> Even this accuses me that I, I, I used to hit him whenever we played together. It's like, that's not true. Okay? You just hit me because I'm you're you're running, I'm walking. Yeah. <laughs> you bump into me, that's it. Uh, it's his fault for being sharp. <laughs> yes. Yeah. Yeah. And being Maybe. that fast, you know. You eh. can only go as fast as you can go. Yeah. So back to Laos. <laughs> uh, so yeah, it was Shrock and Sabio in the middle. Uh Shrock goes in on one of the players. Uh, but what they were saying before that was that well, it was th that incident with Misa where they, he got the punch in the face and it really should have been red card. Yeah. Letter of the law and any referee who sees it yeah. gives the red card. Um, do you think that affected that later on? Were the Azkals angry because of that? Were they reacting because of that? Or they, is it no matter what goes on, they should still be professional? About no, of course, I mean, we've all played, you know, sometimes the miscues of the referee really affects us. Mm. Um, what happens is, yeah. <laughs> I think, uh, I, even in my personal experience, you know, whenever the referee calls, I mean, calls a non-call or sometimes misses a call, you know, you tend to be angry and then sometimes you, you tend to, um, I don't know, get revenge on the player or something like that. So it really messes up your game. So your, your, your focus is no longer the game, it's really getting <coughs> even. Yeah. Um, we, can, we can say that playing at, at a certain level, but when you're representing your country yes. at a national level, you should. on TV, you know, the guys are getting paid, you know, they're, they're constantly set adverts and, mm. and so on. They, it's hard to do it in the heat of the moment. You, it's easier you said than done. I mean, it, yeah. it, it shouldn't happen. You know, but it does happen. Well, it does happen. I watched the, the tape of the Algeria Libya game from 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 Chile. It was just like World War Three. It was very similar to to Laos against uh, against. It happens mm. at any level. It happens, and uh, it should. Should it, should you it does. control it at that level? Then. Well, yeah, the thing about it is, they, they, you know, with it being on camera, most games on camera now, we, we, these these things should be looked at, and the, the guy should be picked out that it missed, and he should get, you know, three, four, yeah. five match ban. Yeah, yeah, how how difficult match, is yeah. that after after the match? Why can't you? Yeah. You know, it's, it, it should be done if if, if it's on camera. Well, well, well I think the rule is if the referee includes it in his report, well, but yes, I don't think should. he can because yeah. he hasn't said so it. So he needs changes. So, yeah. There was one player who got, uh, it was in the Premier League, he got suspended after the game for diving. Uh, oh, I can't remember who it was, but that was post <laughs> the referee didn't say, it was after the game, so it was, uh, it, the referee hadn't seen it during the game, but it was included after due to the TV. Eduardo? Eduardo, um, was it? No. I don't know, it might have been. Uh, so that's definitely that should 
be something that's looked at because uh, it wasn't just uh, at the end of this ruckus, it was Misa and one of the Laotians who got sent off. So both teams were down to 10 men. Yeah. But clearly during the fight and the, the event before it that preceded it, there were a lot of fists being thrown. And if there isn't that uh, discipline, then, then everyone loses their heads. They, they do get angry yes. about calls because of that. Um, whose responsibility do you think that that would that would be really to, to go with it as the, the the after the event to, to start those suspensions? Well, there, I think it would be it starts off with the referee, definitely. Not just the. the <laughs> <laughs> Oh, anyway, not, not just the, the, the <laughs> head referee, but also the linesman yep. and also the fourth official. That entire group should know, even though they didn't see it happen that same, mm. at, at that exact moment. I mean, after assessing what the game, they should already make that consensus on what happened, what should be done after, mm -hmm. should these players merit punishment. Because it, you, it's not just favoring a team, it's favoring the, 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 it's favoring the game. Mm -hmm. Because... Uh, people are now thinking, you know, um, because of missed calls, um, that the, the game is more physical. It becomes like this. I think it's all down. It's yeah. down to the to, to the management initially. As well, yeah. I mean, you know, if, if anything happens in, in 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 worldwide football, it tends to be the manager who who, who, who gets blamed for for ill discipline of his players, mm -hmm. and rightfully so. And and you know if, if Vice thinks that certain players did you know did something wrong, then whether it was protecting a teammate or not, if, if you if you had the tooth knocked out and I've gone to protect you, I'm I'm still technically in the wrong. Yeah, it should be dealt with by the referee, the two officials. Easier said than done. We know that. Mm -hmm. So I mean you know, but then again, is he going <coughs> to, for instance, if a young husband would he would he say young husband you banned for two matches because of ill discipline on the pitch? No, he's not. It, it, it has to be done by by some. Some governing body who said, "Okay, yes. after the game, we're going to look and we're going to penalise you." I think what usually happens is obviously the refs or the, the football association, say in England, will review the tape yeah. and they'll come out and yeah. say a game ban, two game ban, and a fine. Yeah. But also, sort of running hand in hand, is the club will then say, "We'll look at this internally." He's been given a free match. He's been given a fine. Five thousand pounds is on two hundred thousand pounds a week. Yeah. Well, you know, it's, it's, <laughs> that's going to work. But it's not me that's fining them, is it? Yeah, yeah, that's, 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 wages. No. That's yeah. what usually yeah. happens. Yeah. yeah. So the club sort of apologise for what's happened and handle it internally, and the football association will give them a ban. Yeah, after the after the game, a lot of Filipinos are really mad at Laos for that. Though so to be fair, uh, firstly to the management, Dan Palami did come out and issue yep, a statement yep. yes. where he disavowed anything. It was like they shouldn't have done anything like that, yes, yes, regardless yes, yes. of any provocation. That's a very very good move. Um, in this part. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. Correct thing to say and correct thing to do. Yeah. Yeah. And also, um, the, the the game wasn't decided by this. Laos had already won the game by that point, pretty yeah. much. They were one 0 ahead at that point. Uh, and it wouldn't really have changed the result. Laos were the better team on the day. Yes. Um, but uh, that, that's how it goes sometimes in football. Sometimes you, you win it, sometimes you lose it. Uh, both in football <laughs> and in your head. Yeah, at the yeah. end of the day, cooler okay. heads prevail. So, oh, you know, I mean, maybe was Mesa the cooler head? I, no, definitely <laughs> because of Neil. his missing. Mm. <laughs> Neil. Neil was a cooler head <laughs> during that time. But anyway, yeah, I, for me, at the end of the day, we all see that this part of the game, we all say that it's part of the game. Mm -hmm. There's a thin line, yes, but you know, we can't really judge, like, oh, since we're all Filipi we're Filipinos, we're saying that, oh, it was Laos who... who yeah, I'm Filipino, I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm was Filipino. that the royal way? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I, I, I'm more influenced by yeah. English uh, <laughs> association than we <laughs> thought. Eh? <laughs> it got into my head that Roy's from Cebu, because every time <laughs> someone comes in, I always tell them, Roy's from Cebu, Roy's from... He's a fake Brit. <laughs> but, you know, at the end of the day, I'm Filipino, you know, you can't say that just because we... I mean, the Laos team was a, was was much better than us, um, just because they were more physical than us in terms of not just because of the fight, but in terms of you see the entire game, they really want to win it wow. more than the Philippines. So, yeah. you know, kudos to them because they show their heart out there. Mm. So, you know, we can't really badmouth them because of a certain incident because it involves two, the Philippines and Laos. It wasn't just Laos pertaining uh, wanting to fight. So, well, go back four years ago, the Philippines were the Laos, yeah. Yeah, you know there were the, the, the Laos is like you know back to the Ascals thing, which I, I think we can forget about that going forward. 
you know, they're, they're now the top dog, the Philippines, and, and teams are going to come, yes. want to upset young husband, which is quite easy to do, you know, <laughs> and, and want to kick him and, 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 and give him some, some talk and yeah. thing. And it's, it's the responsibility of the players to now realise that they, they have rise to... rise above it. Yeah, to rise above it, yeah. 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 No one likes someone coming in and sort of beating everyone yeah. or having a bit of money. And they've done it yeah. in a short period of time. Yeah. You yeah. know, th this has happened in quick. three years, yeah? That the, the Philippine national team is now arguably one of the best teams in this part of the world. Yep, yeah, yes, absolutely. And what a fantastic, you know, fantastic thing yeah. and achievement mm. that is for, for, for the Philippines. Yeah. yeah. And to see more about that progress with the upcoming Philippine football uh, peace cup, though we, we're not sure how many of the players will be suspended <laughs> for that one. Definitely <laughs> Misa, uh, and with pending cases also with the, the disciplinary committee. Yeah. But for the uh, but for the Ascals, uh, whichever ones do eventually are allowed to play for that, you can follow us at uh, FTW Sports to, to find out more about that. Shout well. out to Gabi Bora, mm -hmm. congratulations for uh, making it to the team for UPEN. Um, the only walk-in amidst all the recruits <laughs> present. So, uh, kudos, um, good job, and congratulations again.